Today we're briefly going to go over how to remote access your office computer. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, the very first thing here on our screen, if you look at, to the far left, you'll see that we have our cell phone connected to the screen here. Um, we want to go ahead and download an app called Google Authenticator. Uh, we go ahead and download that from the App Store. And once you download that app and open up the app, you'll notice that it basically gives you a blank screen if it's your very first time. Here we have a lot of uh, test scenarios that we've done, but at the very bottom you have a plus sign that you would click on the plus and then you could scan a QR code. Now the QR code that we're scanning is the very first time you're signing into to our remote access website. Um, our remote access website is IT support 247.net. So we head on over on the computer to IT support 247.net. It's going to ask you for your email and your password. Uh, these credentials you should already have. Um, if you don't have these credentials, that means you haven't been set up through us. So please give our office a call or shoot us an email at support at vtechgroup.com. Um, let me go ahead and log in with this test email. So we're going to go ahead and blur this account out. Uh, but we'll put it in an email here. And the password. And the very first time you log in, again, you're going to get this screen asking for a QR code. So on your phone, you're clicking on scan a QR code. That's going to open up the camera. So as soon as I point this up at the, at the screen there, at the very bottom there, we can see that we just got our new number, our IT support. So we go ahead and type in that number here. And that number changes every 30 seconds. So you got to be careful and try to speed up and enter the number. So we go ahead and submit. Now, once we enter that, from that point forward, anytime we want to access this website, we would just open up the Google Authenticator on our phone, and that should show us our new code. Now, on the computer itself, now we have a list of computers that we have access to. So you can see the list there on the screen. So on the far left, on the very first line, there's a little green computer, or there might be a different color computer there, but if you hoover your mouse over it, you'll notice that it says click to access your computer. So we go ahead and click on that little green button there. And you'll get another, would you like to join a session pop up? We want to do launch app. And basically from here, it should be bringing up the computer screen of the office computer. Now, in order for this to work, the office computer screen needs to be on. You know, here, here it is, the office computer needs to stay on overnight or whenever you're trying to access that computer. So just remember to leave the computer on at the office and it should be good. Uh, this was a quick tutorial on how to remotely access your office computer uh, through the VTech portal. Um, if you guys have any questions, please shoot us an email at support at b-techgroup.com or give our office a call at 713-952-2333. Thank you.